intelligence of some collies is almost unbelievable. And yet every day, such dogs all over the country are helping their masters protect their flocks. For thousands of years, dogs have offered protection, companionship, and love to man, their master. More than friends, more than pets, are the dogs who spend their lives bringing light into the darkness. Trained to the exacting duties of the seeing eye at Morristown, New Jersey, the German shepherd dogs of the blind must learn to think their way around many difficulties that their masters never sense. This dog isn't fooled by the fact that he can go under the obstruction. He sees that his master can't and chooses the safer way. Everyone who has and loves a dog thinks that his dog is the best. There are all kinds of dogs, more than 100 different kinds and breeds. Centuries of breeding and selection have produced each of these varieties of dogs for special purposes. Greyhounds have been bred for speed, and plenty of it. Deep chests, narrow bodies, muscular backs, and straight, powerful legs, all combine to make the streamlined Greyhound the fastest dog in the world. Alaskan Huskies have the job of hauling heavily loaded sleds over snow-covered hills and plains a job that takes plenty of power and endurance. The husky's strong shoulders, sturdy legs, big paws, and compact sinewy build make him the ideal animal for this sort of work. 
and his weatherproof coat helps him to keep mushing along the trail through snowstorms, sleet, and biting winds. Some dogs, like the wire-haired fox terrier, are quick as a flash on the getaway. A lot of nervous energy give them quick acceleration and dash. The collie's good temper and disposition, together with his size and strength, make him one of the best of all watchdogs for safety. But if we're after economy, all that the little chihuahua could eat in a month wouldn't even take the edge off the big fellow's appetite. No dog has ever been developed to combine the qualities which give us power with economy, fast getaway, and speed with safety. This outfit gives Joe only the barest transportation. No style, no comfort, no safety. To get comfort and style and safety in this transportation, we will have to call in help. A job like this requires the aid of technicians and plenty of muscle too. But when a group of specialists like this starts to work, it doesn't take very long to get some results. A good stout spring mounted here will absorb a lot of those jolts and bumps. A steering wheel with a good comfortable grip is a handy thing to have around, especially on curves. Modern streamlining adds so much to the car's appearance that the boys just can't do without it. And a little upholstery, tastefully arranged, will make them think that they're riding on the clouds. Now it really looks like the job is getting someplace. This is a combination that's hard to beat. Careful plans, a smooth working production line, and plenty of ambition. Next, a windshield and some windows that won't break are added, with no draft ventilation to keep everything up to date. And Bud, who seems to be in a receptive mood for all kinds of gadgets, is in favor of brakes, too, because who knows when he may want to stop. The big job is finally finished. How it'll perform is the question that worries him now. It's a question that worries others, too. He certainly has improved the comfort of his one dog-powered trundle beal, but in order to get comfort and safety, he's had to sacrifice speed. And he's lost practically all the reserve power that he originally had. What's to be done about it? Here's a chance for the boys to throw their engineering abilities into high gear and solve this problem in a hurry. Snap! And just like that, the answer comes. More power, more dogs. And now Joe is the proud owner of a six-dog-powered sedan, probably the only model like it ever turned out. In addition to the extra comfort, this canine cabriolet has some more speed. Nothing flashy, of course, but enough for everyday purposes. There's plenty of power in the Dogmobile 6, too. Enough so that it can trundle up a hill like this in, well, in less time than before, anyway. Under certain conditions, the Bow Wow buggy has some pretty peppy getaway, too. Men and boys alike have always expected everything good in their dogs, and it is remarkable that the dogs have developed outstanding characteristics in response to these expectations and demands. And the same qualities of speed and protection are demanded in the modern motor car. And remarkably, the engineers have bred these qualities into today's automobile. Everybody wants a flexible car to meet the requirements of modern traffic conditions. Everyone wants some comfort, freedom from vibration on smooth highways as well as on rough roads. Freedom from jolting and jarring. Plenty of room to stretch out and relax. Speed, a fast car, so that we can take long trips in a short time. A car that will give us the thrill of traveling out on the open roads. We want plenty of power. Power in our car to carry us safely up long, steep hills, or wherever the going is difficult. We want quick starting, a car with plenty of getaway, so that we can get out of the way of the other fellow. We want safety, a car that will offer ample protection for ourselves, our family, and friends. We want beauty, the finest of styling and design. 
We want all of these qualities. None of us want to sacrifice any one of the important characteristics that give us what we need. And the engineers have done better with the automobile than nature did with the dog. For modern science has produced a car that satisfied all the demands of all drivers. Today's motor car is all in one.